Hello, and I'm back, and today we're gonna be talking about some glitches in School of Dragons. I know, big shock. Okay, this game is just full of glitches, and I think we can all agree. So the first one is right here in practically any stable. So when you go, for example, here, uh, and exit after that, your active dragon will just kind of like teleport you and this doesn't work twice like now if you move to another area and do the same thing again it won't do that i'm just a bit confused by it it doesn't really make much sense because for example if you open this then your dragon wouldn't teleport you so i don't know what causes this glitch i mean it's not like it hurts anybody this glitch is like not a problem or anything it's just kind of a strange thing that i've been noticing for a while so that did anybody else notice this For the second thing, this is something that annoys me so much. I, I can't express how much this annoys me. So it is this. These dragons should all be in the order that you got them in. But they are not. This is not the order that I got my dragons in. This is completely messed up. And it's so annoying. And it actually, I realized that this happens exactly every single time. So if I were now to log out of the game and come back in, they would all be placed correctly. So I just don't get it. This is, it just makes it so hard to find anything because it is completely random. And I don't know. Like, for example, the night lights, like sometimes they're all together like this. But sometimes they're not. So the next thing is the light for your shadow. I mean, this is still pretty annoying. I mean, just look at this. This doesn't make any sense. The shadow is not even centered. It doesn't... It What? And this also, this isn't a glitch, but it's just an annoying thing that happens all the time. Okay, so as I was mentioning, this shadow makes no sense. Your viking shadow is also then floating, there's nothing here. It's just such a strange occurrence, and I have my shadows at like high quality, so this shouldn't be a thing, but this has been a thing for so long, and I'm actually wondering, like, is this a thing for other people? Does your Light Fury have this problem too, if you have a Light Fury? Like, please tell me, I don't want to be alone in this mess. And as you can see now, when I've logged back in, all of my dragons are suddenly in the right order. How fun. Okay, so the next dragon is my Hobgoblin, and I feel like this shadow problem is probably worse than the Light Fears. I mean, there's this weird shadow on it. I mean, you can see it. Like, it's just so freaking strange. I don't know what is this supposed to be. Why is it like this? I mean, this is the reason why I'm wearing the skin right now, because it makes it a little bit better. So the next thing is this, this little icon that shows you the picture of your dragon. As you can see here, my light fairy looks like she's wearing the toughest skin, but she is not. I have removed that skin a long time ago, and that picture still insists that she's wearing it. And same goes for Toothless, the dread dreadful skin. I, I don't have it on him right now, and I'm just so confused why those pictures just decided to get stuck. Okay, but probably the weirdest of all is my Titan Flightmare. Why is it pink? Why does the picture show that it's pink when it's clearly not pink? I'm 99% sure that this dragon was never pink, even before I turned it into a titan. It, it never was like fully pink. Yes, it had pink details, but not the base color. Okay, so this next thing absolutely confuses the hell out of me. I just don't understand it. So on every flight suit, and I love flight suits, I love collecting them, uh, you have this option that you can remove the helmet. This is completely normal for every flight suit. There's no problem, no glitches, except on the Slaughterwing Dragon armor. I do not understand why on this armor you can't remove it. There's no way to remove the ugly ass hood. And you might think like, oh, it's not ugly, it looks pretty. And yeah, with the wings, like when you can see it in this menu, it looks very pretty. But when you actually exit the menu, it kind of, I, I don't like it. I don't like how the hood looks. It just kind of looks weird. It makes your head look giant. And I would just love to remove it. But why exactly this fight suit, literally the only one that I really want to remove this on, it doesn't allow me. And when we're already talking about fight suits, and wait, what the hell is now happening? Why, why is my dragon following me a bit? The, my dragon is trying to eat me. Like, I've seen this glitch before. I don't know what really causes it. It's just... Gr okay, great. You know what? This glitch can go into the compilation. This wasn't actually on my list, but um, how convenient that School of Dragons decided to show that, hey, we have more glitches than you. That's what you were going to show. 
Okay, but what I was talking about was flight suits. So let's just talk about this for a second. So when you're gliding, it should look like this. And when you dive, your hands go together. But then they don't go apart. You need to press W yourself to go into the normal position. I think this is very stupid because I remember that this wasn't always a glitch. And then it just became a glitch. Like, I don't know what happened. I don't know what they messed up, but um, can they fix it? So the next thing I want to talk about are mystery chests, and this is just, it's a bit messy, this doesn't really hurt anyone. I'll open these, for example, but when it falls, it's quite glitchy sometimes, many times you can't see the chest. So another thing is dragons running on water, so if you were ever wondering how can somebody run on water in this game, you can't. It's a visual glitch. I know, I'm very sad too because when I first saw people walking on water, I was like, oh my god, how are they doing it? I want to do it too. But it's completely a visual thing, you can't actually do it, and it's quite sad. Then we have battle events, and this is a very glitchy thing in School of Dragons, I mean, like, there's this glitch in which you just cannot hit the ship. And yes, you can probably, like, turn off multiplayer and turn it back on, but then sometimes you won't get the prize on the end, sometimes you will. I don't know, this is a very strange thing. And there's also a problem with the game, for example, if you do the battle event correctly, but then it just doesn't give you a prize. It's like, oh, it failed to load your prize. And it's like, oh, thanks for nothing, I guess. So that's it for now. I mean, I, I bet there's gonna be more glitches that I'm gonna find. Maybe I'll even make a new video about it, but hopefully not soon. So yeah, anyways, that will be pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video and bye.